All right, we got a little update here. Uh, we are essentially doo -doo -doo, just getting south of George's Bank region. And the weather forecast is not looking that great. Winds uh, up in the mid 20s, uh, gusting up into the mid to high 30s. <laughs> which uh, will be hitting me just about the time I start getting closer to George's Bank. So I'm gonna try and give it a little extra uh, room. But uh, you can see actually. Uh, I think this is sort of the edge of the stuff coming up. You can see some of the bigger, bigger clouds back there. So we'll see. But uh, got the boat prepped, got the storm jib ready. One of the reasons I'm a little bit not concerned but uh, wanna be totally prepared is George's Bank has some of the craziest currents around. It's a really dangerous place in a blow and if for whatever reason this decides to explode a little and turn really ugly, I wanna be able to be ready with the storm jib and things like that, so. Welcome to the midnight world that is Mighty Sparrow. Looking back, there's the uh, old nav station. I got a lot of the extra lights on. These are blinking for some reason. I don't know why, but this is what it's like uh, if I'm full on in a place where I have to navigate and everything. So I got all the stuff on. Get the old uh, trick breakers. Got all the charts. Ooh, that one's getting real close to land. VHF, AIS, old school GPS plot. All right, well, I am officially almost cracked out <laughs> uh, pass over uh, the east side of George's Bank through all the fishing fleets and scallopers and who knows what well, all through the night um, slept half an hour so far <laughs> the wind is just howling I did see a basking shark which probably about 18 feet long which was super cool um, but it's foggy out the wind's blowing I'm just a few miles from proper Gulf of Maine so uh, yeah pretty pretty good looks like uh, another 24 36 hours and I should be in Rockland so feeling good but feeling really tired just want to get uh, past George's Bank proper out of the currents, out of that stuff, and uh, then be able to uh, take a nap. Uh, I can't wait. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be good. But exciting, very exciting night, but also poof, tough, very tough. So almost there though, home stretch. All right, little update. Uh, just woke up from a very long nap, five hours. I can't believe I was dead asleep for that long. But uh, we are in the depths of the Gulf of Maine and, uh, oh, holy cow. Look at that, mighty sparrow. But, we got about 50 miles to the outer islands of Matinicus, uh, and then another 15, 17 miles to get into Rockland. So it looks like a uh, landfall tomorrow, or today, because it's after midnight. 